If you're a family member and your loved one has PTSD, the first thing you can do is educate yourself about the condition so you understand what symptoms may be caused by the condition. That it's not that the veteran is just being a jerk or being hostile and aggressive all the time and doesn't want to talk to you about his war experiences. It may be that this is a symptom of PTSD, and if you as a family member can understand that, you can be of more help to your veteran loved one. So educate yourself is number one. Number two is uh, talk to your spouse or your family member and say, look, I saw on the web, I read this article, I watched this video that talked about the condition I think you may have, and I want to be of help to you with that. It, and what, what often happens is the, the veteran doesn't understand what's wrong with them. They don't understand why they get angry all the time and they can't enjoy the things they should enjoy in their life. What, what happens is they just do it and then they feel guilty about it and they don't want to talk about it. They're embarrassed about it. So they don't talk to their family members. Understand if you're a family member, this is what may be going on. And so instead of getting angry and upset, well, you never talk to me about anything. I mean, you talk to your buddies more than you talk to me, your wife, or your husband. Instead of doing that, recognize that this may be part of his or her condition, and you plant the seed that I'm on your side, and I want to work with you, because I, I want the old John back that, that was here before you went off to Iraq or Afghanistan. And working together, I think we may get there. And then third is suggest appropriate treatment.